Hi, this is Daniel and welcome to first unboxing slash review video on this channel. Today we are going to unbox Rode Wireless Me Bluetooth microphone. So let's go for it. Okay, so this is how the box looks like. As you can see, nothing special. At the back you got all the accessories you got in the box. Let's see what's in the box. So let's open it. Okay, so that's all what we got in the box. And now let's see what we got here. Okay, so silica gel, nothing special. Next we got here cloth case for the Rode wireless mics. It feels quite good, to be honest. So the cloth case. Next we got here the microphones, the receiver and transmitter. This is the receiver. This is how it looks like still wrapped. This is the back with the clip. Okay, so this is the receiver the power button, this is the top with the microphone and the LEDs, the edge with the USB-C and wireless me logo. Okay, and the second one is transmitter, this is the main microphone, as you can see this is how it looks like from the side, the USB-C, the power button, there you got microphones and all the LEDs. Let's pull down the foil. Voila, Rode wireless me and of course the receiver as well with same logo at the front so those are the microphones in the box and let's see what else we got here so this is the box with accessories let's see what's in the cable for your dslr another cable usb-c cable in case you want to use it for your android or notebook and lightning cable in case you are using it for the older iPhones. Okay, some stickers, that kit, and the second that kit as well. And nothing else in the box except this manual. Okay, so that's all what we can find in the box of the Rode Wireless Me. What is really not so bad for the price of around 120 euro. Okay, so that's all what you can find in the box of the Rode Wireless Me. Now let's make a test of the microphone itself. Okay, so this is the test of the normal microphone from my phone. At the moment we are not using the Rode Wireless Me microphone. This is test of the Rode Wireless Me Bluetooth microphone. Just opened from the box, plugged and recording. No application, no adjustments, just the recorded sound. Okay, so this is the test of the Rode Wireless Me right after I just installed the application. So basically now, every time I want to use my Rode Wireless Me, all I have to do is plug and record. Okay, so we already saw what's in the box, how the microphone actually sounds. And here are a few pros and cons I found about this microphone. And no, it's not going to be sound or price tag. You say it yourself, whether it's good enough or not. Okay, so the first positive thing I have to mention is the rubber bottom of the clip at the both the receiver and transmitter of the Rode Wireless Me. Thanks this when you will clip your receiver at your phone, there is lower chance it will just simply slide as the rubber holds itself good towards the screen or towards the back of your phone, but at the same time, thanks the rubber, it will not scratch your display. So win-win situation very good step forward but at the same time i don't like one thing at this clip you know on all those pictures around where they are using the wireless me or the wireless go or anything they are using it at the top of their dslrs but in my case with my nikon i cannot slit it there because it has tiny teeth and basically i can't slit it into my dslr so yeah while the rubber thing with the clip is a big thumbs up this is uh a little bit thumbs down. The second positive thing I would like to mention is the easy plug and go. I simply unboxed it, plugged it and it worked. After that, of course, I also installed the application. Thanks what I even updated the software, but yeah, it still worked before. And as I said, anytime since now, when I want to record something, I will just plug it and record. Easy as that. The second thing I don't like about this is this. I thought it was the manual on how to work with the Rode Wireless Me, but no, it's just something about the warranty and so yeah, this is something what I really don't like about is that you don't get the manual straight into the box, but you have to go toward the website and frequently ask questions and uh, like it's not a big deal, but yeah, 
cons. Another positive thing I would like to mention is all the stuff you got in the box. You saw it already in the unboxing, all the cables with the DSLRs, with the mobile, for the notebooks, everything you got in the box, the dead kit, the cloth case. But um, yeah, with all that stuff, one thing is still missing. What about charger? Like, of course, I got some USB-C chargers at home, but why not in the box? That's the first thing. The second thing is I read on the internet, not every USB-C cable can charge those. Fortunately, mine could, but apparently some USB-C cables will not charge your Rode Wireless Me microphone. So yeah, why not just put it into the box? I have no idea. Another positive I'd like to mention is that even receiver has its own mic. That means that if you want, you can record both yourself and your cameraman behind the camera during the video as well. So this is really cool. Another thing I didn't like is when I bought it and I read on site, it's made for iPhone, iPad and iPod. I was really stressed that it will simply not work with my Android phone. Fortunately, it's just labeling that also iPhone users can use those. But whew, yeah, I was really stressed that I bought something for Apple while I'm an Android user. So this is not like pros or cons, just saying. Another thing I love about this microphone is its compatibility. Basically, you can connect this transmitter or even receiver with any of the older wireless Go and Pro and basically any of the older Rode Bluetooth microphones. What is great and basically almost nobody is doing it nowadays everybody else will give you new charge new cable new operating system or anything road not and for this big thumb up yep so that's basically it. that's all for this unboxing and review video let me know in the comment section what you think about this microphone whether it's still worth to buy it even in 2024 for me definitely but let me know your opinion and yeah okay so that's really all for this video hope you are good and video fine. Thanks for watching and all of the support and see you all next time.